guys, welcome to my YouTube channel. My name is Claire Elizabeth and I'm on a mission to spread happiness and love through the simple pleasure of cake. Today I'm going to be making a cookies and cream layer cake, so I'm going to show you exactly how it's done. I have got my chocolate cake ready to go here. I've just trimmed and leveled the cakes. You can always use a spirit level if you want to get things really perfect. Now I'm ready to start making my cookies and cream buttercream. I have got my buttercream here. For a simple buttercream, what you need to remember is that you need twice the amount of icing sugar to butter. So for a small cake like this, you're going to need around 75 grams of butter and 150 grams of icing sugar. Make sure your butter is really soft and sift in your icing sugar so there are no lumps and you just want to beat it until it's really light and fluffy. To this, I'm going to add some biscuits. I'm going to use a mix of Oreos and Bourbon biscuits just to mix it up a bit. So these now need to be crushed. I am using my rolling pin, so I'm literally just going to bash these biscuits until they are in little pieces. <laughs> Once your biscuits are sufficiently broken, you want to add all that to your buttercream. I used around four biscuits for this. You might want more, you might want less. You just have to give it a go and see what it looks like. Then carefully mix this in. <laughs> say that is looking rather good it smells so nice now we're going to use this to start layering up the cake you want to just take a small amount and spread that evenly on top of your first layer Place your second layer of cake on top and just gently press that down. Make sure it's nice and level. And you basically want to repeat this process until you've completely layered up your cake. done that it's time to start doing the sides of the cake you want to make sure that your buttercream is really nice and soft for this it's just going to make the process a whole lot easier I'll just take a sip of my coffee look my cup has Mickey Mouse on it how cute just take quite large amounts of the buttercream and just start spreading it on because we'll neaten it up at the end anyway. Now that I've done this first layer, this needs to be chilled in the fridge before I move on to the second layer of buttercream.
probably going to need around three to four layers of buttercream to get a sufficient coating, but just keep going and chill it in the fridge in between each layer until you can no longer see the sponge underneath. And that's it, now you're ready to start decorating. I'm probably gonna top mine with like a chocolate drip, but you could just leave it as it is and maybe decorate with a chocolate drizzle and some cookies on top to finish. I really hope you enjoyed this video. If you liked it, please hit the thumbs up button and subscribe to my channel so I can make more free content like this in the future. And if you have a baking question of your own, please do pop it in the comments below and I will happily answer it for you. I'll see you next time, guys. Bye.